guys, it's Monique with EMG TV. Today I'm going to show you an easy way to upgrade the stock electronics in your EMG equipped guitar with our EMG solderless conversion kit. Our one or two pickup conversion kit comes with everything you'll need to upgrade the electronics in your guitar. Two high quality volume pots, two high quality tone pots, a bus, and all the quick connect cables you'll need to upgrade the electronics in almost any two pickup guitar. So why would you use a conversion kit? By upgrading your stock electronics to a completely solderless system, your guitar will perform and sound better. Not to mention that you can easily upgrade your guitar with any of our EMG active accessories like a boost or active tone control. For this install, the only tools you'll need are a Phillips head screwdriver, a pair of wire cutters, wire strippers, and a wrench. For my wrench, I'll be using the EMG hex driver. We're going to start by removing all the stock electronics, except for the pickup selector switch, which I'm going to leave in there. So now that I've removed everything except for the switch, I'm going to go ahead and route the pickup cables through the cavities and connect them to the pickups. So now I'm going to connect the pickups to the quick connect cables, making sure that the arrows are facing up. So now I'm going to mount the solderless pots to the guitar. I'm going to make sure that the lock washer goes on first and that all the pots will be facing the same direction to make it easier to connect them later on. The finishing washer will go on the outside and I'll tighten everything up with the hex driver. I've gone ahead and installed the pickup selector wires to the bus. The neck position goes into the selection marked neck, the bridge to bridge, the output will go into the selection marked output, and the remaining black wire goes to ground. Keep in mind that the color of your selector wires may be different based upon the brand of your guitar. Now we're going to secure the bus into the control cavity. Make sure to clean the area a little bit before you place the velcro so it stays secure. So now we're going to connect the output jack wires to the output jack. and feed the cable through the cavity. Take the battery wire and feed that through the battery route. Then I'll connect the battery wire to the last remaining terminal on the output jack. Now I'm gonna connect the pickup wire to the volume pot. and the volume pot will get connected to the bus using another quick connect cable. And we'll do the same with the bridge pickup. Next, we're going to connect the master tone to the output jack. Using a quick connect cable, I'm going to go from the master tone to the section on the bus marked out. Now I'm going to connect the remaining red wires to the red power section of the bus. and then you can install your battery. Before we close everything up, I'm gonna do a quick tap test to make sure that everything's working properly. You can plug your guitar into an amp using any standard quarter inch cable. Today I'm using the EMG Vovox cable, and I'm gonna gently tap on the pickups using a screwdriver. So now you're ready to string up your guitar and play. I'm Monique with EMG TV, and for more information, go to emgpickups.com. Thanks for watching.